Dude! Rhino? What? <laughs> yeah. Where you at? You get into the apartment, okay? Yeah. Your mom let me in. Unpacked slash dumped my stuff all over your floor. And now I'm in the park, grabbing some air. Oh, perfect! Dip over to the amphitheater. Got something to show you. Dude, is this spider related? Please tell me you got a piece of Rhino's horn or something. Things I've seen of the fight are straight up nuts! <laughs> definitely spider related. And definitely better than a horn. Oh, loving the suspense. I'm there. never get used to you doing that. Hey, look. Check it. Christmas present from Spider-Man. Open it. Dude. Put it on. I'll cover you. Oh, what? <laughs> never seen a guy change clothes in Central Park? Okay. How's it looking? Whoa. Miles Morales, congratulations and welcome to your very first super suit. Head uptown for part two of this amazing gift. This is only half of the present. Well, what's the other half? I'll let you know when I find it. Welcome to Just a Facts with me, your truth slinging host with the most, J. Jonah Jameson. What? Does Pete said his suits to autoplay Jameson's show? Guys, a masochist. Sad news, <laughs> listeners. My Christmas charity spectacular was canceled due to. Masked vigilante mayhem! Gotta be something better on. Uh, been hearing good things about this one. Hello, I'm Danica Hart, and this is the Danicast, where I spotlight the people making a real difference in our city. Today's topic? Oh, well, you know, stockbrokers, profit colleges, people make internet videos autoplay. <laughs> No, obviously we're covering the Spider-Man's incredible takedown of Rhino. Subscribe, Danicast, new favorite podcast. Looks like Pete set up a lot of gear. Miles, get ready for your first holographic training challenge. These challenges are spread throughout the city. Each one focuses on a new move or technique. This one focuses on acrobatic improvisation. Get into position to start. Hollow training? Oh, I am so down. First up, air combat. Fighting the enemy on your terms is a great way to gain the advantage. Now follow up with a mid-air attack. And now a personal favorite, the swing kick. This holotech is next gen! With the right parts, but I can make it portable!
disarmed opponents are far less dangerous. And it's crazy satisfying to knock guys out with their own weapons. Total twofer. All right, yeah. This is dope. Bless Peter Parker. Now let's combine these two moves. Airborne enemies is a great method of crowd control. Plus, the sound they make are hilarious. Classic. Got something for you. Combat simulation is active. <laughs> Gear we can sell. Uh, oh crap. Spider! Take them out! Then grab the gear! Y'all trying to catch some hands? Yeah? Okay, let's go. Take the spider out, then grab the tech gear. We're gonna make bank selling this stuff. Just so you know, this is official Spider-Man tech. Y'all are not authorized to resell. for the tech thieves. Now to fix a training sim. Critical fault on circuit AF-15. Colonel Panic. Well, let's try a BIOS reset. Nice. That did it. Well, looks like Pete made stealth, swinging, and combat challenges. Gotta check these out when I get a chance. I think you should check out Roxxon Plaza on your way home. I just walked by and I'm pretty sure someone's breaking in. Uh, yeah. I'll look into it. Hey, so I want to hear more about your new spider powers. I think it's some kind of bioelectric discharge or supercharged static electricity. Ooh, we gotta name it. It's about venom power. You know, because it stings. <laughs> okay, that's not bad. I'm gonna run. Plaza first, then home. Remember, Venom Power. Trust me, go.
friends, thank you so much for telling people about this podcast. We've jumped the charts from 136 to 87. Like, uh, wow. <laughs> Hi there, I'm Simon Krieger, and what you're standing next to is a new form reactor. Once activated, this reactor will supply enough energy to power all of Harlem. Now, I'm sure you're thinking, Simon, how is that possible? And the answer is new form. Just one canister of this revolutionary fuel source is enough to supply Harlem with clean, safe energy for the next 500 years. Soon, we'll be opening reactors throughout Manhattan and then worldwide. Get ready for a planet powered by Nuvor. Roxxon, we're here for you. What was that? Hmm. No sign of anybody. He broke a bunch of stuff. Maybe they were looking for something. Huh. We did a search for new form. What are they gonna do with it? <laughs> Yeah. 
shipments. I need to figure out what they found so I know where they're gonna hit next. Christmas dinner sounding pretty good right about now. I'll look into that group and the new form shipments tomorrow. Better steer clear. Don't want them thinking I'm the one who broke in. Middle school graduation. Haven't seen these two in a while. What was that? All good. Little spill. Get it cleaned up real quick. All good. <laughs> it's all right, man. Ay, bendito. Mijo, qué guapo. <laughs> Gracias, mami. I invited a guest tonight. Can you get the apartment ready? Oh, uh, maybe put on some music, set the mood? Ah, oh, Nadja. Really? Your campaign manager on Christmas Eve? Well, tomorrow's rally isn't going to plan itself. Thanks for getting the apartment ready, mijo. Hello? <laughs> hey, Nadja, ya nos dieron el permiso para mañana. Fifteen years in Brooklyn without a stain. Then we move to Harlem. Might be a sign. Glad Dad's tree survived the move. Oh, me too. He loved that little guy. Ain't no Christmas like a Brooklyn Christmas. I miss hearing him say that. Hmm. No records. Hey, Mom. Where's Dad's vinyl? Um, should be in my room. Thanks. Yo pensé que ya habíamos llenado ese formulario. Oh. Guess mom's not done unpacking either. Heirloom. That wallpaper just screams abuela. Well, what's that? Huh. Must have gotten mixed up in the move. One of dad's old case files. Who's the prowler? I wonder if dad ever caught the guy. Haven't looked through these since before City Hall. Dad's favorite album. He put this on every Sunday while he made coffee. <laughs> the 
Mom ordered like a hundred of these because the article mentioned Dad. Who is the Spider-Man? If only you knew, Ma. Bleached borax? Borax with bleach? Boraxed bleach? Hey man, you guys have any regular bleach bleach? You sure bleach is a good idea? Yeah, for sure. Why? No reason. What's the pick, DJ? The greatest record ever. This is perfect. Low key, classy. You didn't like jazz when I was little. Your dad taught me to love it. That doorbell's been broken for years. Miles, could you get that? Of course. How are your parents, Genki? I haven't talked to them in a while. They're good. Finn? Hey, fixed your doorbell. <laughs> it's so good to see you. How are you? It's been like... Months. A lot's changed. Yeah, it really has. Is that our guest of honor? Come on in, you two. Dinner's almost ready. Finn, I'm so glad you could make it. Thanks for inviting me, Miss Morales. <laughs> we missed you. Well, this one especially. <laughs> uh, hi. Finn, this is Genki, my friend from Brooklyn Visions Academy. Genki, this is Finn, my best friend. <laughs> my other best friend. <laughs> Oh, yeah. You guys won the middle school science fair at County, right? You made a, uh... Energy, energy converter? converter? Jinx! <laughs> huh? oh. uh. The wiring in this building is such a mess. I'll check the circuit breaker. Gracias. So, Christmas by candlelight? I promise I didn't break it when I fixed your doorbell. I hadn't considered that. No good. Breaker doesn't have power. Looks like the whole block's out. Let me check if I can see anything from the fire escape. Okay, honey, but be safe. Definitely can't get to the transformer from here. Unless you're super sticky. on the roof. Can't go up there. Yeah, got the whole block. Really hope no one can see me up here. Push rocks on reacting though. And this would be a problem. I don't know. Rocks Don't look out the window. Don't look out the window. I hope so. Hot plates are only going to get us so far in salvaging this dinner. Bioelectricity can take down Rhino. But can it save Christmas dinner? It worked! Oh, man, those lights are bright. Did not think this through. Gotta get back inside ASAP. still outside? Actually, oh. uh, what about a photo? <laughs> right now? Yeah, you know, precious moments. You gotta capture them. Shouldn't we wait for Miles? No, he hates photos. <laughs> All right, everyone squeeze in. Ready? Great photo, great photo. Oh, hey, Miles. Uh, who's ready to eat? You guys sit down. I got this. Mm, smells good. Mm. <laughs>
<sighs> Finn, tell us everything you've been up to. You still in robotics club? I had to quit, but I've been studying biotech on my own. Nerd. Ugh, says the guy who has to wear an ascot to school. <laughs> hey, only on Tuesdays. <laughs> Does your brother Rick still work for Roxon? I don't know how anyone could work there after seeing your last campaign ad. You went for Simon Krieger's jugular. <laughs> that reminds me. Genki, you have a certain flair for social media. Could you spread the word about tomorrow's rally? Yeah, we'll be trending by midnight. <sighs> Sometimes it feels like Simon Krieger's my real opponent. Roxxon has so much influence here, but they don't answer to anyone except their shareholders. Harlem needs someone to fight for the community. That's Mom's campaign speech voice, in case you couldn't tell. <laughs> uh, you want to proofread these before I post them? Yes! Do not hit send! <laughs> so, what's going on with you? What do you mean? You seem... I don't know. Distracted. Want to talk about it? Not tonight. It's Christmas. Hey, how are you handling the move from Brooklyn? I mean, it's fine. Ugh. You hate it. No. That's your, I hate it, but I'm too nice to say it voice. No, it's, I don't know anybody here, and I'm always having to ask for directions. You need to find a good restaurant. A barber shop, somewhere you can shoot hoops. You'll settle in. What if we hang out tomorrow? Just the two of us. You're not too busy? It's winter break. I can put off homework for at least another week. Okay, I'll text you. It's a date. I, I mean, not a date, uh, you know, a, a friend date. Still as smooth as the last time I saw you. <laughs> Miles. What? Uh, you awake? No. So I stayed up last night and designed an app for your new suit. Thing's got a crazy custom OS, nothing I've ever seen before. But I ran it through a disassembler so I could reverse engineer the plugin architecture and... Uh... <sighs> you just fell asleep again, didn't you? Miles! I'm up. I'm up. It's almost done compiling. Oh, thank you. Ready to try out my app? Yeah, man. Let's do this. I'm connected to your analytics. Let's test drive this baby. All right. Everything you see, how are you not puking all the time? Lots of practice! <sighs> Welcome to Friendly Neighborhood 1.0. It lets New Yorkers directly request your help and report crimes in progress. Nice UI. Thanks. Oh, look! Someone just made a request! Request came from a guy named Aaron Davis. Wait, what? That's my uncle. Does he know you're Spider-Man? No. Gotta be a coincidence. Uh, I'm headed to the subway stop. <sighs> what is going on? Uh, hey there. You needed some help? I'm Spider-Man, by the way. Yeah, I know. Aaron Davis. I think somebody's messing with the sensors. I'm getting bad data from the main relay up top of Grand Central. On my way. Wait! Wait! Yeah? Where's the other Spider-Man? Oh, he's on vacation. But don't worry, I got this. <laughs> he definitely didn't recognize me. Oh, 
He's calling through the app? This is Spider-Man. Hey, forgot to mention. There was a break-in last night right next door at Roxanne Plaza. Who called the Underground? Caught him hanging around my stop this morning. The Underground? You know anything else about them? They think of themselves as a young mafia. They've been around a while, but now they've got a new boss. Tinkerer. Tinkerer? Thanks for the tip. So, uh... You call Spider-Man often? Like, for help? <laughs> Didn't really have a way to get in touch with this app thing. But I saw you on the news last night taking down Rhino. Figured you were the right person to call. <laughs> cool. Have you, uh... <laughs> Been working at the subway long? Nah, took the job last year after my brother. Well, anyway, I was trying to make some changes. Decided this job was a good place to start. The trains going down on my watch doesn't exactly paint me in a good light. Well, when we fix them, you can tell your boss you showed initiative by using the friendly neighborhood Spider-Man app. <laughs> I'll do that. Good luck with the sensors. There are way too many wires on this one. It's got to be messing with the signal. Where do these cables go? Should follow the cables from the sensor. being jammed by something. Hmm. This is crazy tech. Hate to do this, but... Sensors are back online. What did you do? Took care of the guy messing with it. And it looks like they left some of their toys behind. Hey, I'm gonna have to call you back. Whoa. Bet I could use this to make those hollow drones Pete designed. This tech has a pretty unique RF. Wonder if I can track it. Huh. Looks like there's a bunch more of these around the city. Perfect time to try out those new hollow drones. Hey, get back! Oh, the hollow tech! Look out! Hey, Underground! We gotta stop running into each other! OK. 
Okay. Hope the trains are running again. Check in with Uncle Aaron. Yeah. Hey, Mr. Davis. How are things looking now? I've got a signal, but no trains on the tracks. It must have gone down at the yard. It was the underground messing with your sensors. I'm thinking. Does Roxxon ever use a subway to ship new form? Roxxon? Uh, the subway system was designed to carry people, not freight. But this line got some updates when Roxxon Plaza went in. So they could be using it under the table? Hmm. I'll follow up on it. So, uh, you mentioned your brother. You got other family? I haven't seen them in a while. I had to make some changes, like taking his job. But I miss him. Especially my nephew. We used to mix beats together. Well, maybe now you could see him again. Them. Your family. Hope so, kid. Yeah, uh, I should go. Fight underground. Bye. <laughs>